All right, hey guys, welcome to Tabletop Baseball. It's time for the Ron Guidry replay from 1978. It's game 22 in the replay so far. He's 13 and 5. 166 and two thirds innings pitched, 137 hits, 55 earned runs, 50 walks, 152 strikeouts, 15 home runs, and there's the actual numbers to this point. They're playing the Twins, and here's what actually happened in the game. New York wins it, 4-3. It was no decision for Guidry. He remained at 15-1. He went 6 and two thirds, six hits, two earned runs, three walks, ten strikeouts, did give up a home run. That was to Kusick for the Twins. Roger Erickson will be pitching for the Twins. So it's a righty versus a lefty. Willie Norwood's going to lead off for Minnesota. And here we go. 4 1 is a 1 and then a 4 2. 4 2 is going to be a ground out to second base. Or, yeah. One away, Bob Randall. 5 4 is a 45 and then a 5-2 is a 1 so 46 in column 5 and that's a fly out to center uh, so 2 away Royce Smalling 2-1 is a 43 and then a 2-6 is a 1 so 44 in column 2 and that's going to be a ground out to the pitcher, Ron Guidry. So nothing for the Twins. Here's Mickey Rivers. 3 6, it's 47. And then a 3 3. So 50 in column 3. 50 in column 3 is going to be a single. Versus a right-handed pitcher. So Rivers at first, Randolph. You can hit away. 6-1, 16, 6-3. There's a 2, so an 18 in column 6. That's a fly out to left. Thurman Munson, 6-3 is a 16, 6-5. So a 19 is going to be a fly out to right. Four five for Chambliss, the six, and then a four two, second base. That's Randall. He's an eight. No, he's a two. That'll make it an eight in column four, and that'll be a ground out to first. Top of the second, Dan Ford, 4-4. Four, 4-4 four. Four, four is a 2, and then a 4-2. It's going to be a ground ball to second. Willie Randolph makes the play there. Craig Kusick, 6-5, 36. And then a 6-6 six, six is a 39 total. Is a 39 in column six, and that's a strikeout. A one two is a 35, and then a two one two is a 36 in column one. It's ground out to third for Jose Morales. I don't need to move that. It's a habit. Lou Pinella, 5-4, is a 27, and then a 5-2, hold on, there we go, and then a 5-2 is a 2, so 29, column 5, 29, the fly out to center. Reggie Jackson, 5-3, 8, 
and then a 5, 4, 10 in column 5 is a lock. And he's got a, a D there. So it's a letter D, and if alphabet letter indicates the following, the batter reaches base safely. The next base is open. Roll two dice. Refer to that letter on the action chart. Here we go. Column D on the action chart. The three. Stolen base E. So stolen base possible error. Stolen base, stolen base plus possible throwing error on the catcher. Roll against the catcher's error rating. Rolls higher. All runners advance an extra base. So Reggie steals second. And then we have the error rating of Borgman. It's a 51. It's a 61. So that'll be a wild throw. Roll is higher. The error on the throw. Jackson now third base after the Bad News Bears situation. 4-4 four, four for Nettles is an 11 and then a 4-6. Second base, Randall is a 2, so a 13. Um, with infield in, 13. Is 12 to 16 is possible error. Roll against his error rating. He's a 52. It's not. Not higher. It's a 42. Plays the same as a 7 8 above. So slow ground or defense has two options. Take the sure out of out at first as runners advance or try for the lead runner. Roll one die against the runner's lead. Lead runner speed. It's higher. He's out on the fielder's choice. Not higher. Everybody's safe. Well, Jackson's a four. It's a slow roller. I think they're going to have to go to first. A five and a six is all you can roll, and he would be out. You take the chance of him being safe and the batter being safe. So I think they're going to get the sure out of first. Jackson will score. Two away, base is clear. Roy White, 3-4, 30, and a 3 2 is a 232 column three. It's a line out to right. I think that was a logical play. I'm not trying to, you know, play favorites or anything, but I think that was the logical play. Here's Bombo Rivera, 3 5 is a three. Column three, does it change? A 42. Right Yankee Stadium, so it stays a three. And then a three one is a one, so four column three is a fly out to right. Larry Wolf five one's a five, five six. Five six is a four, so a nine in column five, and that's a walk. Brings up Glenn Borkman, the catcher. Air cost him a run. 4 3, 17. And a 4 3 is third base. That's an 18 in column four. With the infield halfway, grounder out of first. Wolf to second. Here's Norwood. 2 6. Is a three and a sixty six makes it a five. 
Makes it a five, and we have the center fielder. He's not going to get there. Rivers is a four, but he's not higher than the number next to the 60, which is a five now. So the ball falls in for a double. And there are two outs. Runners advance two bases, scoring from first. Uh, there's no nobody on first. So it is a double for Willie Norwood. Scores Wolf. Tie ball game, 1-1. One, one. Bob Randall, 6-5, is a 31, 6-2, is a 32 total. That'll be a strikeout. The bottom of the third, Fred Stanley, 5-2, is a 1, 5-5, five, five, is a 3, so 4 in column 5 is grounded to short. Mickey Rivers, 5-3, the 6, 5-4, so an 8 in column 5, the walk. And he has a C, so we'll check the C of the action chart. It's a 10, and we get a plus. Stolen base or caught stealing. If the blue died, which I didn't roll, it's a 1. Uh, if the blue die is higher than the catcher's defense rating, it's a stolen base. If it's not, the runner's caught stealing. It's not higher, so he will be caught stealing. Randolph. Alright, so I got off my scoring corrected. Stanley hit the ground ball. Rivers walk, got thrown out. Now it's really Willie Randolph, two away. Base is clear, 4 5 is a 2. And a 4 4 is going to be a ground out to short. All right, top of the fourth. Roy Smalley. Well, the twins, 2-5. Two 2-5 five. Two is a 16 and a 2-5. So one seventeen. That is a strikeout on a 17. So Roy Smalley. Here's Dan Ford. 2-6 is a 4. And a 45 is going to change that to a 3. It's going to drop to a 3. And we have the left fielder. Left fielder Pinella is a three. So it's not higher, so it'll drop in for a hit. Dan Ford drops one in there in front of Lou Pinella. A 6 3 is a 36. 6 1, so a 37 is a strikeout, column six. A one three is a two, and a one five, so a three, that'll be a strikeout. So three strikeouts in the inning. Single sandwiched in there. Bottom of the fourth, Thurman Munson, 5-5, five, five, is a 15, 5-2, so a 17 in column 5, and that's an infield single. That is an infield single. Check in with the action chart for their on-base action. Does that mean if there's runners or do it anyway. I'm going to do it anyway. Four 
is a PB. Pass ball. The blue die is higher than the catcher's pass ball rating. All runners advance one base. It's a two, and his pass ball rating is a six. Borgman. So it's not higher. So no pass ball. Five five fifteen. And a five four is a two seventeen. Column five, and that's another infield single. And we got to check in with the action chart again. An eight. Wild pitch. If blue dies higher than a wild pitch. Um, Erickson is a two. It is higher. It's a three. So it's a wild pitch uncorked by Erickson. Now second and third with Lou Pinella. Nobody out. 6-3 is a 31, 6-2 is a 2-33, column 6, and it's a pop out to second. Runners have to hold, there's Reggie, 4-6, six, 16, and then a 4-6 is second base, and that's Randall, he's a 2, so an 18, with runners on second and third, everybody's in. And we've got an 18. Uh, let's see, 18 is it 17 to 19 is a single knockdown by infielder. Knockdown by fielder. Runners advance one base. So that'll score a run. First and third, one out, Greg Nettles. 4-1 is a three and a 4-6. His second base again, Randall. Uh, that's going to make it a five. And this time the infield will be halfway with the runner at first. And that'll be a double play. Two to six is a double play. Six would be... You'd have to check the pivot, man, but it's a five. So a four, six, three double play. Gets the twins out of further damage. Give up one. On top of the fifth, Rivera, five, four, is a three, and then a five, one is a one. So a four. Column five, and that's a grounder to short. So one out, Larry Wolf. And it's a two four. Two four is a 16 and a two six. 17 in column two is a strikeout. Glenn Borgman, 5-3 five, is a 5, 5-2 five, is a 1, so a 6 is a walk. Two out walk to Borgman, here's Willie Norwood, 2-1, 35, and a 2-1 is a 36 in column 2. It's a ground out to the pitcher. So bottom of the fifth, Roy White, it's a 4-1. Four 4-1's one. Four a 1 and a 4-6, it'll be a ground ball to second. Fred Stanley, 5-3 is a 5, 5-6 five, is a 4, so a 9 in column 5 is going to be a walk. One out walk to Fred Stanley, here's Mickey Rivers. Drop the blue D6. There it is. 
a 1, 2 is a 2, and a 1, 1 is a 3. Five column ones, a strikeout. Two away, Willie Randolph. Five one is a five. Five two, so seven in column five. It is a walk. Second walk of the inning. First and second, he's not going to steal because there's somebody on second base. There's Thurman Munson. 4-5 is a 2, and then a 4-3 is third base, so that's a 5 with the infield back, and that'll be a ground out to first, and two outs. So top of the sixth, Bob Randall's 2-1 to one Yankees. 3 2, 11, 3 1, 13, column 3, and it's a line out to short. Roy Smalley, 5 6, is a 4, 5 5, so 7 in column 5, and that's a walk. He's got the J, so we'll go to the J of the action chart for further details. And we get a 10. We get a plus. Stolen base or caught stealing. The blue die is a 1. It's higher than the, it's a stolen base. If it's not higher, he's caught stealing. It's a 1, so he's going to be caught stealing. Roy Smalley is caught stealing. He is going to be caught two to four. Two away, Dan Ford. Three five is a 30, and then a three six. 31 in column three. Line out to left. Bottom of the six. Chris Chambliss. Five five is a 15. And then a 5-3, a 17 in column 5, and that's just another infield single. Infield single, M of the action chart. 4, PB, blue die, is a 3. It's higher than the catcher's rating. It is a pass ball. Borkman is a four, so it is not, or a six. I guess six is his pass ball. So it is not a pass ball. Lou Pinella, six six versus the right. He's a fifty nine, and then a six five, so sixty two in column six, and that's a double into the corner. Runners advance two bases with two outs. There is not. So Chambliss to third and Pinella to second. As he rattles one in the corner, second and third. And they may be looking at the bullpen here. I think they're going to go with Scarcy. Scarcy. To face Reggie Jackson here. It's all for Erickson. It's a 1 4 is a 2. And a 1 2, so he strikes him out. Greg Nettle. 3-1 is a 4, column 3, 35, and that will be a drop to a 3, 
and then a 3, 5, so a 6, and a 6 in column 3, and that's a short fly out to center, but we may have a sacrifice fly here. Check with third base coach for sacrifice fly, adding 1 to the outfielder's arm rating. Center field is 43, so it'll be a four. Third base coach. Uh, and we've got Chambliss, he's a three. So it's gonna be a minus one, because speed minus arm, he's a three minus a four is minus one. We get a five. But he is going to advance. The extra base, lead runner is safe, advancing, easily advancing an extra base. So it is a sack fly. And a big run there for the Yankees. Three to one now. Two outs, Roy White. One three is a two. And a one one, so four is a strikeout. Garce does a decent job, gets three outs, does give up a run, but it's not credited, it's credited to Erickson. Cusick, a 5-1, is a 5, and then a 5-5, five, five, 3, so an 8 in column 5 is going to be a walk. One out, walk, or one out. Not one out, one on, nobody out. 3 1 is a 4, and then a 3 2 is a 1, so a 5 in column 3. It's a fly out to left. One 3 for Rivera, and a 1 3 is going to be a strikeout. Oh, sorry, Larry Wolf, that's probably loud. 2 2. There's an 11 and a 2-6, so 12 in column 2 is a single. You got the 2-6, which is no, no asterisk there. So it will be a single to left. Runners advance one base with two house runners on second scores. Well, there's two outs, but he's not on second. So Boardman, two away, first and second. 4-2 is a six. And a 4-1 is going to be first base. So an eight. And that'll be a ground out unassisted. Then feels back. Two to eleven, some ground ball, ground ball to ground out to first. That's what it is. Bottom of the seventh. Fred Stanley. Five six is a five, and a five three is a five. So a ten in column five is a walk. Second walk for Fred Stanley. Mickey Rivers. I think he's going to bunt. He's a two bunter. I get a five. Five is a good sack bunt. So that brings up Willie Randolph. They're going to bring in Mike Marshall. Mike Marshall come on with one out. Stanley is second. Willie Randolph the batter. It's a 2 6. 2 6 is a 3 at this point. And then a 24. That's going to drop it to a 1. And we've got the right fielder, which he should get there on a 1. Rivera does.
but runners on second and third advance one base if their speed is higher than the outfielder's arm. Stanley's a three, and it is not. All right, Thurman Munson, two outs. Six five. 36, 6, 5 is a 1, so 37 in column 6 is a strikeout. The Yankees cannot capitalize. But Willie Norwood, top of the order, 1, 2, 35, and a 1, 4, 36 in column 1 is a ground out to third. Nettles making the play there. Here's Randall. 2 4 is a 50. 2 5, so 51 in column 2 it is a ground out to the pitcher. Royce Molly, 1-4, 35, and 1-2, the 136 is ground out to third. So it's bottom of the eighth inning. Chris Chambliss, 3-3, three, three, 32, and then a 3-3 three, three is a 1. So 33 in column three, and it's a line out to center. Lou Pinella, 1 6, 45, 1 4, 47 in column one, and that'll be a strikeout. Reggie Jackson, 3 1, 13, 3 4. He's a one, so 14 in column three, and it's a line out to third. Last call for the Twins. 4-2 is a four. 4-3 four, is going to be a ground out to third. Cusick hit the home run in real life. 2-2 two, two is a 15 is a one. If it's not shaded, does it not, does it still change? Do you go to the ballpark if it's not shaded? I don't know, 55, one, and then a two, three. Uh, first of all, um, let's see, it's a one, and we have the uh, three is center field. He's going to get there. He's going to make that if, the, if you go by the, just go by the one. So I think we just leave it at the one as the one right there. And that'll be a fly out to center. Basically saying if the center fielder is a one, he's not going to get there. Five six is a three, and then a five two is a one, so four in column five, and that'll be the ball game. It's ground out to short for Jose Morales, and a fine game pitched by Gidry is three to one final. Yankees win it. Gidry goes nine. Gets a W and gives up how many hits? One, two, three, three hitter, one run. It was earned. Walks and strikeouts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven strikeouts. Gave up a few walks. One, two, three, four, four walks. 
No home runs. Let's check those strikeouts again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, just seven. So if you compare, he goes the complete game here. Only went six and two thirds in the actual. Six hits in the actual. Much better here. Three. Two and one. Three and four walks here. Ten strikeouts. Only seven here did give up a home run. But he's going to move his record in the replay to 14 and five. Compared to 15 and one in reality. So that's just, that is going to wrap this one up. Once again, thank you guys for joining me as always. This is Tabletop Baseball Earl. And until next time, you guys have a great evening. Take care. And God bless.